Now time for one of our favorite segments, Better Bet, pretty self-explanatory. The best segment. Yes, the best, the best segment. segment. There we go. All right, let's start with those quarterbacks. Here are their season-long passing props. We have three of them, but you have to pick an over for the guy that you're picking. Okay, so no under options. Got to pick one. I'm going to go with Kirk Cousins to go over. I, I don't trust Russell Wilson to play out a full season, so he's off the board. And Baker Mayfield's coming off a career season. Everybody knows how I feel about guys coming off career years. They're very hard to replicate. That's why they're called career years. For Cousins, we're asking him to go over a mark. He's gone over six times already in his career. So it's not a huge ask, especially when you factor in 11 home games that will be played indoors, one of the best offensive lines in the league, and an arsenal of weapons that should give him every opportunity to put up big numbers this season. They should have a top flight running game in Atlanta this year as well, keeping the defense honest. So I'd play Cousins over 41 and a half rushing yards. Pass yards. If he runs for that many yards from a rushing perspective. Well, in terms of the passing yards, I am a little bit concerned because, you know, new team, new head coach, new offensive coordinator. Yeah. He should be successful, but he is still coming off that injury, and he is rather later in his career. So I'm actually going to go with Baker Mayfield. I know he's coming off a career season like you had mentioned. He had over 4,000 passing yards. He's still got Chris Godwin and Mike Evans, two wide receivers at over 1,000 receiving yards each last season. And yes, again, career gear, that's great. But I also think he has something to play for within the division as well. So I'd rather go with him rather than Cousins, you know, just because of the new team. And then also Russell Wilson. I mean, he's still competing with Kenny Pickett. So it does feel like the number is much, much lower than these other guys. But I do like Baker Mayfield to go over. Mike Evans back in the mix. Huge for Baker Mayfield field keeping that, that offense is. intact and with Atlanta there to push him now they're going to go you know what to the wall for most of the season can't fall Absolutely. on that one. All right let's move over to running backs here yeah. are the season long rushing props we got Saquon Derrick Henry Zach Moss who you liking. I'm a big Zach Moss fan coming into I this season. I know you season. are you mentioned that yesterday. I think there's a lot of upside he's 18 to 1 to lead all free agent running backs in rushing this season. I mean look at the kid he's 26 years old he has fewer than 500 total carries on his legs. He's stepping into a situation in Cincinnati that produced Joe Mixon. Mixon went over this mark in four of his last six seasons with Joe Burrow at quarterback Jamar Chase at wide receiver. You're going to have to respect the passing game. So there's going to be an opportunity here for Moss to have a big time season. Yep. Love these two guys and what they've done. Henry on the wrong side of 30. Barkley injury prone. Josh Jacobs is another option. The Raiders ran him into the ground two years ago. So I'm curious as to how it's going to look for him this year in Green Bay. Age is huge for the running back position as I'm going to pick Derrick Henry. Okay, oh. I know it's going to be his ninth season, but he's been major successful this guy's an absolute beast and if you look at the Baltimore Ravens offense they love to run the ball and now they got a guy like King Henry who can absolutely pound this in the ground I do expect him to have a really successful season and again there is some wear and tear to some degree but at the same time I think the Baltimore Ravens have a great offensive line they're going to be able to use him and they don't have to rely on Lamar Jackson running around the entire time which then can in turn make them more successful per usual literally no agreement between the two of us <laughs> I did that on purpose yeah all right